What is up guys, Steven here and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be doing my 90 subscriber special video. Uh, this is it, I might change my mind if it's not good. Um, but I cleared up my desktop, this is not copywritten or copyrighted, I don't know. It's mainly copyrighted, that's how a lot of people say it. But there's a bit of diamond here I forgot to add red into, but uh, this is all mine. I created this with the red and everything got diamond sword background minecraft logo but i downloaded this new editor it's called hitfilm 3 express and it's a free editor you can upload straight to youtube image sequence and everything but i'm going to make a new project today this is what i just tested out quickly because i'm trying to add a face cam into my videos but enough of that let's go cut and cut so let's import a video first so let's go to rendered and go to h1z1 episode no 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 not that not that uh cut import i have used this a bit um i use jack's h1z1 because uh yeah so put that in here this that's that let's just choose a bit what we want and then go to where is it slice tool yep there we go and just cut all that it's that easy to be honest um and then you can go grab your webcam or facecam footage uh and be root and go grab a footage here and go shop that here it is a bit laggy that's the downside about this uh editor but enough about that there we go so let's cut here so as you can see here we have our two things but you may be wondering how Steven do you get it down to size well technically you just drag it shove that up there I think you click overlay blend overlay no 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 um blend normal and I think for this one I do blend an overlay okay you don't do that either okay, so I didn't really try this out with gameplay footage I just tried it out with normal footage and it's a bit loud all right let's turn down volume quickly um okay there we go Okay, so this is a bit difficult. I'm just trying to get it as good as I can. Um, right, transform, fit frame. Okay, that makes it bigger. Oh, wow, I'm, I'm still in slice tool. Okay, that's, that's what I was doing wrong. Uh, oh, here we go. Okay. Uh, I think if I move along, okay, it's all here. So let's just put this up here. In different ways, you can size it down and do all that, but it does make it look a bit weird and squished together like this. Or I can look back to front and make myself look like I'm looking at the game from this way, which I really like. I've always been wanting to learn how to do that, and with this editor, you can. For now, let's leave it normal size. Uh, you can trim really easily in this software. Uh, go to export, which is here. Um, export. Tony Vegas resource test, and let's go. It takes fairly. It's fairly uh, easy to export. So yeah, not fairly easy, but it doesn't take too long. If you have a good computer then it should only take um if it's a long normal size youtube video about 15 minutes it should take about maybe 20 
to export, not like rendering, but I think they're both the same thing really, so. And start using this to edit, I know it'll be a bit different, I'll try and do it. What is up guys, Jack Lindsay, welcome to a HMZ on the video. Back, sorry about that, uh, everything crashed, my recording crashed when I plugged up. Okay, so as you can see, it's a very a clean render. Turn down Windows Movie Maker. Oh, not Move Maker. No. High quality. Let's go into full screen mode. And as you can see, that's that. So, um, I know it's not that much to do for 90 subscribers, but this is only part one. You don't know what the hell I'm gonna do. So this is my intro by the way, if you like it. I don't know, this is my music as well, and this is... I might actually add that music into the background of this video, but what I'm going to try and do is edit this whole video in this hit film 3 express but when i use this where is it it's really easy to find stuff now uh when i did it in the lightworks it was really difficult these are all my things here oh that's supposed to go into raw raw folders what are you doing here i need the autoplay to get so i can use photoshop uh but it's all clean now and when i'm recording what I'm going to start doing is go to view, show desktop items and turn that off so when it, if my record, if my game crashes, come onto the desktop, there won't be anything private on there. And I can just go to view and show desktop items and they're all back on, very easy. These are all my games as well that I'm going to start recording a few of. Don't ask me how I got Boom Beach because I'm not going to tell you yet. Shall I? Might as well. I downloaded this thing, main application. Main accounts, I'm not putting that up. <laughs> um, applications, here we go. Here's all my app lows. Uh, one, I downloaded this thing called Blue Stacks, and it's basically a tablet simulator. You can simulate a tablet with it, an Android tablet. Sadly not iOS, I'm used to iOS, I have an iOS iPad and a phone, iPhone and an iPad. But you know, I used Android for most of my life, so yes. My singing monster, sadly you can't download, um, what is it? Jurassic World, because I absolutely love that game, it's so fun. But anyway guys, hopefully you did enjoy part two of this part one sorry of this video my night subscriber oh sorry i'm tired my night subscriber special video happy halloween to you all uh and as always wait no punch that like button in the face if you did enjoy it enjoy this video i mean i'm so tired um subscribe for more great content and i'll see you dudes in the next video peace out